Hi, this is your tutorial on how to take a color photo with the instant box camera. We use RA4 negative paper and used black and white and color chemicals to make a color direct positive. We need, from right to left, Dactyl black and white developer, a black and white stop bath, RA4 developer and RA4 bleach and fix, also known as Blix. We are photographing these flowers with a variety of color tones. I'm focusing and loading the paper. There's a special video on regular usage of the instant box camera if you're not familiar with it. I measured the light with ISO 5 and 2 second exposure. In the camera I have the Dactyl developer on the right. It will take about 1 minute and the stop bath on the left. It's about 30 seconds. I take out the photo and we can see a black and white negative. I'm placing the negative into a water bath. As it's not fixed yet, we are actually creating a reversal process. The dark parts will be bright and vice versa. Now I'm placing it into the RA4 developer. That is where the real magic happens. I leave it for about a minute. From there into another water bath. And into the Blix. After the Blix, again into a water bath and here we can really see the final image. As you can clearly make out, the colors are all wrong. RA4 paper is not made for photographing in the real world. We need to use filters. So, I'm going to do a few tests with different filters. The problem, or challenge let's say, is that there's no set filters. It depends on your light source. The first test will be with a Kokin P002 filter. That has worked for me in the past with studio light. I simply place the filter in front of the lens. I measure the light and use the value of ISO 3. The negative looks already a lot better. More tonality. Putting it into the RF4 developer, this part is always exciting, I can see that I do have a better color range, but maybe still too green. After the blicks, into the water and I can clearly see it's still too green. Next test with four filters, an 84 as well as an 84A, B and C. Those four filters with my light condition don't really work, it's still too green. The next test, a Kokin and UV filter. I saw on several blocks that a UV filter is a great solution and I never tried it. The result, still too green. The next test, the 84 filters with a Foma Multigrade M2 filter. That is magenta and it should reduce the green. A bit too blue now I would say and I also have to change the exposure as it will need more time. This test is with the Kokin filter and the Foma M2 filter. Already in the developer it is looking much better. And with the Blix even more so. I think that is my filter combination for this light condition. So I can start a real shooting now. We have more instruction videos on our YouTube channel and the Instant Box Camera website. Good luck and have fun!